take a selfie. Oh, you're right. <laughs> what you just saw is me using Zen Asus's latest Zen phone, the Zen phone selfie, and it's made specifically for the biggest narcissists everywhere. Um, why is it made for selfies? Well, first, it packs dual 13 megapixel cameras, one on the front, one in the back. Both of them have dual tone LED flashes uh, in uh, next to them, so you can shoot regardless of how low a uh, light situation you're in. On the back, uh, it's got LG's uh, Asus's laser autofocus as well, so it'll help you uh, get really stable pictures really easily. Uh, and this phone, if it looks a lot like something you've seen, it is very similar in terms of style to the Asus Zen Phone 2, which was launched earlier this year. It has a top power button, which can take a little getting used to, uh, but it's also a novel uh, way of putting the power button other than on the sides. This phone will uh, come with an OptiCore Snapdragon 615 processor and a 3000 milliamp hour battery, which is bigger than on the Galaxy S6. We're told the phone will be competitively priced when it comes uh, when it's available for sale, and no word yet on whether it will come to the US, but since the Zen Phone 2 did make a splash uh, stateside, we expect this to make a splash as well. Um, it will run Android Lollipop with uh, this is a Zen UI, which packs some nifty touches, like the uh, Zen Motion S gesture that you saw just now, uh, and some cool apps for easier sharing uh, between devices. So this is a 5.5 inch display that's full HD resolution, uh, and for more details and a full review, please stay tuned to Tom's Guide. For more news on the Zenfone Selfie, I'm Sherlyn Lowe.